Greetings everyone. Manopatra brings to you the news highlights of 29th September 2022. Starting with the Supreme Court, the Supreme Court has held that husband is required to earn money even by physical labor if he is able bodied and must maintain his wife and minor child. He cannot avoid his obligation except on the legally permissible grounds mentioned in the statute. The court while acquitting a man who was sentenced to death for alleged rape and murder of a 6-year-old girl has noted that there are serious inherent contradictions in the statements made by prosecution witnesses and both the trial court and the high court have overlooked it completely. The court has allowed withdrawal of a petition seeking to declare certain provisions of Jammu and Kashmir Reservation Act 2005 and related rules as illegal and unconstitutional. The court allowed doing so after court was told of the developments which took place subsequent to filing of plea. The Supreme Court has taken exception to the apathetic attitude of the central government in not considering the mercy petition filed by the death row convict Balwant Singh Rajona in the Chief Minister Beyond Singh assassination case and directed center to do so within 2 months. The court while observing that rape must be held to include marital rape for the purposes of medical termination of pregnancy act has held that wives who conceived out of forced sex by husbands will also come within the ambit of survivors of sexual assault rape incest mentioned in the MTP rules. The Delhi High Court has held that issuance of email attaching electronic notice to an unrelated email address does not constitute due dispatch and therefore the notices cannot be said to have been issued on 31st March 2021 the high court has dismissed facebook india's petition challenging the probe initiated by competition commission of india against it in connection with the national regulators investigation into whatsapp's privacy policy of 2021 news from the kerala high court The Kerala High Court has directed Popular Front of India to deposit amount of rupees 5.20 crores towards damages estimated by state government as well as KSRTC as arising from destruction damage caused to public private property in state within a period of 2 weeks. The High Court has denied bail to 6 Sri Lankan fishermen who had been apprehended by the Indian Coast Guard officials on suspicion that they are part of international drug cartels and had been involved in transporting the same at the time of apprehension the bombay high court has held that dispute between legal heirs cannot be a ground to suspend the liquor license held in the name of a deceased partner of a firm under the maharashtra prohibition act 1949 and rules thereunder The Allahabad High Court has held that a victim has no right in law to drop case of non-compoundable offence of heinous nature which badly affects society and also stated that such cases become matter between state and accused and it is duty of the state to ensure prosecution of offender in such cases that is all for today thank you so much